So you're thinking about moving to Great Falls, Virginia? Well, in today's video, we're gonna give you one of our classic neighborhood tours of the area, show you around three different neighborhoods at three different price points so you know exactly what sort of homes you can expect to find in here and if they're gonna fit your budget. For today's video, we are starting off at the Great Falls Center. This is very centrally located in Great Falls, probably where you're gonna be doing the majority of your shopping with uh, Safeway just behind us right here. You've also got the subway, you've got Starbucks in the area, CVS. I mean, this is probably where you're gonna be doing the majority of your shopping. Uh, there's not a whole ton to do in the area itself. So if uh, you know you wanna get a quick bite to eat, do some grocery shopping, whatever the case may be, this is probably where you're gonna be going. Uh, although you are, uh, you know, you're not super close to a lot of nightlife activities in the area itself, you are around 15 minutes away from Tyson's Corner. You're around 15 minutes away from uh, uh, the rest in town center and also the Dulles town center. What else are we if we if you wanted to go to DC and you were a commuter How far away would you say? Oh, uh, yeah. We are? Yeah, we're, we are very close. We are six miles from 495 That's a major commuting artery which brings you to Maryland where Bethesda a lot of nightlife in Bethesda Chevy Chase and you're probably 15 20 minutes from Washington DC and you're not far from Arlington either so there's plenty of nightlife even though you're, you feel like you're in a rural area, a suburban area out here, you're not far from all the nightlife in all the major areas. This is the place you want to be. Yeah, and the population here is around, what, what do we see, around 14,700. So, I mean, it sounds like a lot of people, but Great Falls is one of the largest suburbs in Northern Virginia. So you get a lot of space for your land as well. Every single home has a huge plot of land, at least half an acre. Uh, we got a guy coming in right behind us here, uh, at least half an acre. So you get a lot of privacy, a lot of space, pretty much anywhere you're going to be looking for a home. So that's always phenomenal. But with that being said, let's go take a look at some of the houses we're talking about. Look at three different price points so you know exactly what to expect. And let's get after it right now. If this is your first time to the channel, as always, welcome. Here we cover everything you need to know about the living, the playing, the working, the good and the bad of Northern Virginia and the surrounding areas like Great Falls. If you want to stay up to date with the market here, subscribe below and tap the bell for notifications so you can be the first to learn about the current market here in Northern Virginia. My name is Tim. And I'm Cindy. And the team and I here, we get calls, texts, and emails from people just like you looking to make their move here, and we love it. So whether you're moving in a day, a year, or any time in between, give us a call, shoot us a text, send us an email, schedule a Zoom call. We'd be happy to help you make that smooth move here to Northern Virginia. Although we showed you the Great Falls uh, Center right here, we're still there. Um, right across the street it's also worth noting you've got the uh, village center right across the street there very quaint area uh, you're probably going to be spending a lot of time there as well going to the pub going to a lot of famous restaurants out there like the pio pio uh, peruvian restaurant definitely worth checking out you've got a, a big field also on the side so if you wanted to take your family if you wanted to take your kids out and get a quick drink get a bite to eat and keep them busy you can just plop them down there on uh, on the soccer field have them play a quick game of soccer lacrosse football whatever the case may be uh, but with that being mentioned let's head off to the first listing and uh, you guys are going to love this one and stick around all the way through to the end because we're going to show you a huge mansion a beautiful home and you're definitely not going to want to miss it but let's All right, guys, here we are coming up on the first listing in Great Falls, one of the most affluent areas in Northern Virginia. Uh, this is probably gonna be the most affordable single family home you're gonna find in the area, but still quite expensive. Uh, the home right behind us is actually the, the, the listing we're gonna be taking a look at today. This home was actually listed at $749,000, uh, four beds, three baths, around 2,400 square feet. So you're looking at a price per square foot of around $308 which is sort of the average around in Great Falls. As I mentioned, it is one of the most affluent areas in Northern Virginia. It's got a two car garage as well. So that's fantastic with uh, the Northern Virginia weather here. You can always keep your car protected uh, year round. This is one of a very highly desirable neighborhood as well. This home was built back in 86. So relative to many other areas in Northern Virginia, it is a little bit of a newer neighborhood uh, relative to some neighborhoods that were built in the 50s and 60s like we've covered in the past. You've also got a monthly HOA fee of around $116. So as we've mentioned previous in other videos, many of the neighborhoods we've looked at actually don't have HOA. So you kind of had that free range of doing whatever you wanted with your property. However, here you are limited to the HOA board. Of course, you can try 
to get something through, but you do have to go through the HOA board uh, first. The location is excellent because you're five to 10 miles from uh, crossing over into Maryland. A lot of people work in Chevy Chase, uh, Bethesda, Silver Spring, and Route 270, um, that, that corridor. Loads of places to commute to, easy, easy commute. And when I say easy commute, I mean the distance, the actual traffic is, can be a little bit of a nightmare. Uh, you have to go really early in the morning uh, so you can miss as much of the traffic as possible. You are also very close to Northern Virginia and Washington, D.C. Living here makes you centrally located to everything and you feel like you're in the country, but you're so close to DC, Northern Virginia, and Maryland. This is a very highly desirable area. Great Falls has always been a desirable area to live in. This is absolutely the lowest price house you'll probably find here, single family home. The fact that you can have a garage is, is phenomenal. You know, a lot of these houses that we've been looking at, you know, in Fairfax City, in other places, don't even come with garages. So it's kind of shocking that the sticker price, I'm sure, for a lot of people, if you're coming from out of town, when you see these kind of houses and think, wow, this is going to cost me, you know, close to $750,000. But that's what you're, you're paying for, you know, location, 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 and this is a prime spot. All right, but that's it for this listing. As always, we're going to jump into the car, show you around the neighborhood, and then head off to the second listing. All right, hope you enjoyed that last listing here. We're walking up on the second one. And uh, you know, as I mentioned, one of the most affluent areas in Northern Virginia. So don't be sticker shocked by, by the home we're pulling up on right now. Uh, I've mentioned in the pros and cons video of uh, Great Falls that the median home sale price inside of Great Falls is actually around, uh, it's around $1.1 million. That's exactly what this next listing is going to be priced at right here. $1.1 million, exactly a four by four, meaning four beds, four baths, um, around 3,800 square feet, putting you at around $288 per square foot and a yearly actually HOA fee of around $375. This house was also built in 1986 and it's got a two car garage. You can't see it right now, but it, it kind of curves into the back or the side of the house just back there. Uh, what are your thoughts on the neighborhood uh, so far that we've driven through? So people like this neighborhood because the homes are spaced out, that they typically are about a half acre, a little more than a half acre. So you have really nice spacing in between the homes. All the homes are impeccably taken care of. I mean, the driveways all look brand new. The, the streets are wide, plenty of parking. Even though there are no sidewalks, you would never have a problem with taking a walk through the neighborhood. Neighborhood. It's just a really well cared for neighborhood. You also feel like you're in a rural area and you're 15 minutes from Tyson's Corner, 15 minutes from Reston, so uh, the Reston Town Center. So it's just a centrally located, beautiful neighborhood. And we've just seen actually a couple of uh, contractors drive by while we were trying to shoot the video. So it definitely goes to show people are taking care of their houses. And just across the street here, you can tell. Uh, there's a couple contractors uh, working on the house here. So people are keeping up with their homes. Uh, the landscaping on this one is absolutely beautiful. This one also sits on, like uh, Cindy mentioned, a little bit over half an acre. Much of the land is going to be on the front yard, but you still get a pretty sizable backyard as well. So overall, beautiful area. It definitely feels a lot more open, although you get a, a ton of trees in nature, which is a theme you're going to notice all throughout Great Falls. There's something about this one that it just feels a lot more open. Uh, a lot lot nicer but with that being said uh, we're just going to take you around the neighborhood as always and show you around the area as well and then head off to the last and final listing
right guys, hope you enjoyed that last listing. As you could probably see with the house behind me, what we're about to pull up on, this is one of the most expensive houses you can get in the area. Obviously there is more expensive, but uh, these are some of the mansions you can expect to find inside of Great Falls. Yeah, a lot of uh, people with disposable income like to come and live here. It's one of the most beautiful areas in Northern Virginia. And as you'll see with the house just behind me, this is exactly why. Uh, listed at $3.775 million, uh, around six beds, nine baths, 11,800 uh, square feet. So you're looking at around $280 per square foot, a $1,500 HOA fee annual uh, as well. And it was built back in 2007. So relatively new build, uh, around 15 years old as well. But this is a super highly desirable neighborhood. I mean, you're sitting on a 1.75 acre lot as well and this is right at the end of a cul-de-sac so you've got no neighbors uh you know peeping in your backyard you've got nobody right behind you so you got a lot of privacy as well i mean that's going to be the case with pretty much every single one of these houses it's just such huge lots you get really good privacy all throughout and you've got trees covering your backyard and the front of your house as well so you, you got good privacy you feel pretty secluded you're right next to the main road as well but uh you don't even feel like uh that's the case but what do you what are your first thoughts on on this neighborhood oh yeah you can't beat this neighborhood you're less than a mile from route seven and route seven takes you to every major commuting route you are close to shopping restaurants this neighborhood is highly desirable because it's just so beautiful you have such privacy yet you're so close to everything people move here because they want the the luxury they want the big yards they want the pools most of the homes in this neighborhood have pools they have pool houses that some some have guest houses you can't go wrong living in this neighborhood i almost feel bad that i can't show you guys the inside of the house <laughs> it, it almost feels uh, wrong but uh you could kind of get a, a a good idea we'll put some pictures up on the video to show you a little bit of the inside of the house but you can get an idea of just how beautiful this area is but we'll take you around this neighborhood as well but that's going to be it for this video hope you enjoyed it and got some value out of it if you did make sure to like it down below if you're thinking about moving to the area or you have any questions about great falls in northern virginia you can always leave a comment or give us a shout give us a call shoot us a text send us an email all the info is down below in the description but until then as always well we hope to show you around town or we'll see you on the next video